In the xy plane, the line with the equation ax plus by plus c equals 0, where a times b times c is unequal to 0, has a slope of 2 thirds. What is the value of b? So this form of a line may be unfamiliar. So I'm going to rewrite it in a more familiar form called slope-intercept form, y equals mx plus b, where, of course, m is the slope. The way I'm going to do that, I'm going to subtract AX from both sides, subtract C from both sides. So I get BY equals negative AX minus C. Then I'm going to divide both sides by B to isolate Y, remembering to divide through to each term. So Y equals negative A over B times X minus C over B. So this piece right here is the slope. And we know that that slope equals 2 thirds. So if I want the value of B, all I'd need to get is the value of A, and then I could solve for B. Well, now we move to the statement. Statement number one tells us that A equals 4. Well, if I know A, I can solve for B. Sufficient. Statement number two tells us that C equals negative 6. Well, C plays no role in the slope. C does play a role in the y-intercept, but we have no idea what the y-intercept equals, so we have no way to use that. So statement number two is insufficient. Notice that in this problem, we did, as it were, all the heavy lifting before we even looked at the statements, so that by the time we looked at the statements, everything was easy. That is sometimes a good way to handle data sufficiency. So this one... Statement number one, sufficient. Statement number two, insufficient. And the answer has to be A.